Hey guys, so um, okay, first of all, I need to say a few, few, few things. So I don't know if my quality is like messed up because it wouldn't let me make it higher quality because it has to do with memory camera is really weird and annoying. But anyway, first of all, excuse my appearance, or second of all, because my eyeshadow was done on the bus and my eyeliner looks kind of a mess. So just kind of excuse that, but I'm just kind of out of it because I had a really, really long day today and it is like 10 o'clock right now. I know that's not that late, but it's a school night and I was in New York walking around all day and buying makeup and stuff. So yeah, as you can tell by the title today is my International Beauty Show 2014 New York, New York haul. And make sure you go check out the vlog if you're interested and to see my experience and how pretty cool it was. So if you want to see that, go head on over to my vlog channel, which will be linked down below, of course. So I'm just going to show you all the stuff I got. And first, let me talk, let me explain that I bought a lot of stuff and I spent a lot of money, but it was on a lot of things and it was so worth it. So yeah, and most of it was my own money. I mean, some of it, like, my parents and grandparents gave me money for it. But, like, yeah, I spent a lot of money. That's all I have to say. So I'm just going to get right into it. I'm going to just kind of grab things, and I'm going to talk to you about the deals that I got. Basically, so if you don't know what IBS is, it stands for International Beauty Show. It's like a hair and spa and, like, nail and makeup show. Basically, it's like eye mats, but it's mostly, like, hair and not makeup but i pretty much focus on the makeup and stuff like that so yeah i'm gonna show you what i got this isn't in any particular order i'm just grabbing out of the bag which is this one it's like just a big bag that was the first place we got gave us a big bag so i use that to carry everything around but this i don't even know what this bag is but there was a little ardell booth thing and i like split a deal i got two pairs of lashes for five dollars it was four for ten but I split it with someone so i got these edgy accented lashes which i think are going to be really fun to try on play with and then these natural luckies i could always use some new lashes so i got that there is this it's called marrakesh and i've had this stuff before it's like a hair argan oil and it was like seven dollars because it was three for ten twenty for their stuff and we like split it with me and two other people so it's just like an argan oil and it's really big a lot bigger than i used to have it so it smells really good and it's just a great oil and then i have this cool bag because bags are cool this is such a good deal. Okay, I don't really know what's up with these bags. I guess it's the brand Audrey Morris, whatever. But, okay, so they had 12 eyeliners, count them, 12 gorgeous eyeliner colors, if you can see that, for $5. $5 for 12 eyeliners. Can we just take a moment? And they're really good quality, too. So, I cannot get over this. They're so great. They're so pretty. And, yeah, I'm going to use this a lot because there's a lot of colors. And then they, I also got the same exact deal with lip liners. And um, I just couldn't pass it up. They have some colors that I will not use probably ever. Like these really brown colors. But I'll try them all and see what I think and let you know. And probably like use some of them in videos. Because I needed a red lip liner and I don't have to go buy one. So that's great. And I'm just so excited about that deal. Because I got 24 pencils for the price of like a mil... Like the price of one regular pencil maybe like one nyx pencil i just can't even explain how good of a deal that is if you can you probably can tell okay so there's two different brush places i went i went to crown and morphe morph i'm not sure how to say it but i think i think these are morphe so yeah yeah these are the morphe ones so um i got three brushes they were really cheap like one of them was probably two dollars and the most expensive one was probably five or six dollars that I bought so that's crazy um and they're like MAC quality so yeah um this one it doesn't have the name on it but it's like a little baby eyeshadow brush for like detail in her corner so I guess I'll just show you that and then this one's like a crease crease brush which I use on Asia but it's like a little smaller fluffier brush for more detailed crease application and then this duo fiber brush that I want to use for blush I've been wanting to get one of these and I never have so now we don't need one it's really soft too. These are really good brushes, like amazing. You wouldn't believe it. And then I don't know what to show you next. Okay. Um, also from Morphe, there is these um, palettes, the empty palettes. I was gonna get a D palette, but it was really expensive. And I mean, these are the same thing because I don't really think I need to depot any other shadows that aren't this size. But they had um, like a 24 or 20 palette pan palette for like nine, and this one was 12 for six dollars. So I guess I'll open it up and show you. It's just the Morphe on the front. Um, 
yeah they also have like makeup but yeah it's a pretty nice palette and you can just put you can depot your shadows and put it in there the shadows i got are single pan which i'll show you soon but i'm pretty sure this fits max and i feel like i should have gotten another one because they're so cheap but i didn't so yeah but that's that it's just a little palette that was really good for cheap and i hope this fits my mac shadows but it's magnetic i believe so that'll be fine so next i'm just going to show you the samples that i got so there is a lot of free samples because this is the last day of the show so first this it's from it's the same place they gave us this bag i really don't want to say it um i'm gonna try to pronounce it it's oblifica i think that's how you say it. it's like a treatment hair serum for um like damaged hair and she was like feeling her hair and, like one of them one of the girls had like thin hair and she was like you need the purple one and one of them she gave me two because my hair's thick so yeah they're just these little sample things so i hope i like those um we got some hair masks from this brand called avena they're like deep volumizing masks that we like at the end we went around and asked for free samples from like all the booths that were cleaning up so got those this Amica Amica nourishing mask. It's a really cute packaging. Like their whole booth had these like crazy pretty colors everywhere. It was so cute. Um, I got these hair masks from Beauty and Pinups. Like for them, and there was a bunch of masks for my hair. I'm gonna have fun trying these out. I really don't know how they work, but <laughs> my hair was gonna be cute. And these little, I think they're different, but I, they look different. But I don't know. I think they're the same. They're from Massey Massey Paris. Um, the color protecting leave-in treatment. I mean, they were free in the baby ones, so I was like, why not? Um, you probably can use it if you don't have to color your hair. I pretty sure you can. Um, but yeah, it's just a leave-in oil treatment. So these things are good little oils for your hair and then the last thing was really great because it was huge and we weren't expecting this it's from i cannot say that uh la braziliana but then there's like it says diki die under the flag i really don't know what that says but it's like a leave-in argan oil keratin treatment thing and it's really really nice size for a sample that was free so they were really nice and great so i'm gonna put these down hold up still more to come I got, there's this like Mika Mika Beauty little booth and they had these like pigments that were so pretty. Um, I'm not sure how much they were. I think it was two for 15 if I'm not mistaken or 16. Um, I They're so pretty. So I got one in Deep Ocean, which is like a navy blue shimmery color. They're all shimmery, but this one is really pretty and it was, I swatched it. It was so pigmented. This one's like, it's called Striptease. It's like a, um, kind of champ I can't really explain the color it's like a bronzy champagne it's like not champagne but it's not bronze it's like a lighter version I don't know where to put this because I can give it the bag but they were had lip stars for $12 so I was debating on which one to get I wanted to get a purple one or this or a nude but I got anime and it's just a really really bright pink and I hope I use this because I have another one that I really don't use so I just have that this little Micah Beauty bag and then the last few things I'm going to show you are like the most exciting so I have more brushes um one of the other these are from Crown but the first thing I want to show you is this one that we got. So we went to this little booth that was having brushes, like four different brushes, for 50 cents each. 50 cents. So I got a new eyebrow brush. They're from, I don't really know where it's from, what brand it is, but this is just a random brand. And it's a little angled brush. So I got that for 50 cents. Cray cray. And I was running out of money anyway, so that was great. Okay, and then from, I believe they're all from Crown, if I'm mistaken. I'm sorry. But, okay. I actually got the wrong one of this. I was going to get a smaller one, but whatever. It's the C105 tapered brush. And I'll just show you what it looks like. It just looks like that. It's like a contour blush brush. So, that could be in handy for contouring. Um, I got this little baby, like, short smudger. It's a C408 chisel shader. Um, if, I can see, if you can see that, I don't even know. But it just looks like this. It's a little baby. It's good for details, like upper and lower lash line and stuff like that. Um, I got this. I've been wanting an up brush like this for a while. It's an angled shadow C418. And yeah, it's a nice angled brush. They're really soft. All of them are so soft. And really nice quality for so, so cheap. Some of the eyeshadow brushes were like $2. I'm like, wow, I must. And $3. Okay, then this one is, oh, this one's, I think this one's by um, 
some of the brand because it doesn't have a label on it, but whatever. It's like a crease brush and a blending brush. I need another one because the one I have like this is kind of annoying, so I got another blending brush. And the last one is like this big oval eyeshadow brush from Crown. It's just really nice, good for, it'll be good for highlighting my brow bone. So yeah, that's what that looks like, if you can see. So those are all the brushes I got. I'm gonna put those away actually right now. So there is a um, color club, there was a color club booth and they were having six nail polishes for $10. You get to pick them out and they put them in a little box. So they were so pretty. I'll just show you the colors I got um, really fast. So I got this gorgeous bright blue. It is called Chelsea Girl. I got this really, really, really gorgeous, like light, super light baby blue, maybe almost periwinkle color called In Denial, like D-E hyphen Nile, like the river. This one called Modern Pink, which is like a, not neon, but it's like a pale pink. It's really nice. They're also really good quality, made sure. And then this one's called Warhol, like Andy Warhol. And it's a, oh, you, this camera's not even picking up, up how bright this is. It's like a hot, deep neon pink. It's gorgeous. I got like all pinks and blues. I don't know why. And then this like minty color called Age of Aquarius or, yeah, Aquarius. It's like a minty blue. It's really pretty. Of course it's pretty, that's why I bought it. And then this like baby blue, pretty, yeah, it's a baby blue color called Factory Girl. It's so pretty. So, yeah, it kind of reminds me of a color I had that like dried out. So yeah, those are those. Um, and then the last thing I'm gonna show you is probably the best deal in the whole world. Let me tell you, these eyeshadows from Morphe or Morph were $2 each. Oh, for for forget. Then they also had these little samples of a mascara from Grande Mascara. It's just these little baby ones that I'm not going to show you too much. Okay, so these eyeshadows were $2. They are the same size as MAC shadows. They are more pigmented than MAC shadows. You see this black on my hand? I swatched that probably like, uh, I don't know, like 1 o'clock today. And it is still there at 10 o'clock. So really, really pigmented, rich, great shadows. They're um, all like single depotted shadows for $2, so I got a bunch of them. They are amazing and gorgeous. I got seven, yeah, seven. So they don't have names, just numbers, so I'll show you. And I'm going to be using these so much, um, putting them in my palettes. So this is number 59. It's like a hot, it kind of matches my, it's like the same color as my shirt. It's like a pinky, reddish color. I can't really explain it. This, oh, it went in backwards. This is number 20. It's like a really, really pretty, super richly pigmented, like, kind of reminds me of satin taupe, but more, more warm, sorry. And it's like a bronzy color, but it's like so unique. It kind of looks like MAC Woodwink. I think that's what it's called. Okay, and then this matte turquoisey blue in number 41. It's like, it's kind of the color of one of the nail polishes, but it's like a green blue. Um, this... It's number 11. It's like a really gorgeous copper color. It looks exactly like MAC coppering. So it's so pigmented too. I like touched my finger in and it was so pigmented. I can't even explain to you. And then this black is like the best black ever. It's like 10, 10 times better than carbon. Number 28, a matte black color. So just matte black. Okay, number 19, which is a really gorgeous, like, emerald green, which is so, so pigmented. Some of them weren't so pigmented, but I got the ones that were. And then number 25, which is like a, it's a kind of burgundy brown, so it's not straight up maroon, but it's not straight up brown. It's really pretty, but yeah, that's what that looks like. So pretty. So, so yeah, that's everything I got. So much stuff for such a good deal. Like, I, as you could probably tell by what I told you, I got these seven amazing eyeshadows for $2 each. So that's $14. That's not even equal to one MAC eyeshadow, and they're better. I mean, I'm not gonna say, I'm, I'm not saying I'm not gonna buy MAC eyeshadows because of these, but they are so good. And they have some colors MAC doesn't have, or they don't, like, only pro colors that I can't buy. So yeah, that's my empty, oh, Blissica professional bag that I carried around all day. It's all destroyed. It has like lipstick all over it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Go over to my vlog channel, like I said, and check out the vlog from today. It was fun. We took a lot of pictures. We just had a great time just buying makeup and, you know, walking around, getting, watching some people do hair. It was really cool, really fun. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe to this channel. If you haven't already, go subscribe to my vlog channel. I'll put out videos every Saturday, like on this channel. And yeah, go watch my vlog and um, make sure you comment. 
on, I don't know, leave a random comment or something. But yeah, I love you guys. Have a fabulous week, and I'll see you next week. Bye!